is a hf and jersey crossbred cow and it's brought from sagar of uh, shumaga district and the history of this animal was recurrent bloat timpani anorexia and high fever since the last 20 days uh, the, the thing one thing you what you can observe is there is a brisket edema in this season brisket edema what you can see this is known as brisket edema and the pulsation is jugular pulsation jugular pulsation is there then the lymph nodes are markedly enlarged you can see that the lymph nodes are markedly enlarged then you can see the cows from the left uh, right side the left side of this particular cow here the huge swelling is there this is the huge swelling is there huge swelling is there because of the accumulation of the fluid it is uh, having such huge swelling. This indicates the problem of uh, involving the heart. This brisket edema indicates the problem involving the heart. And we are going to escort uh, this particular animal. Yeah. I am getting the feeble sound and I am not audible about the heart sound. This indicates that the there is a clear cut evidence that this animal is having some cardiac problem. So what we have to do is this is known as this is known as traumatic reticulopericarditis or peritonitis case. That means this cow has ingested some nails or this is also known as hardware disease. So to get this uh, hardware out we have operated, uh, operated in this area. We have operated in this area. And this operation is called as ruminotomy. And we have opened it in this area and uh, removed the content and we have removed the nail from the stomach of this particular animal. Uh, this is the area where the diaphragm is existing. This is the area, diaphragm is existing. Then a material has come from the rumen and pierced here. Pierced here and because of this thing the heart is enlarged heart is enlarged. That's why there is a trauma is caused, trauma is caused to the heart. That's why it is called as traumatic reticulo pericarditis or peritonitis. The catheter we have inserted into thoracic cavity of the animal to reduce the fluid which is accumulated in the thoracic cavity so that the pressure on heart is reduced. So uh, today we have inserted this particular catheter and we can see that this particular edema may be reduced because this is also known as, a, known as congestive heart failure or CHF because there is a continuous pressure on the heart and the heart becomes enlarged and uh, the heart is unable to have the function. That's why in this case we have put this particular catheter so that the reduction in pressure of the fluid. Thank you. Thank you.